How's it going, guys? This is Lucian Sword back again today with some more Brawlhalla content. This time, bringing you guys a look at the next legend that's going to be in Brawlhalla, codenamed Soldier. Uh, this legend was shown in the dev stream, I believe, yesterday. If you're watching this today, no, wait, it was shown Tuesday, I think. Anyways. Um, let's go ahead and look at uh, the replay of the dev stream. Skipped right to the le uh, the soldier uh, part where they show him off. Uh, keep in mind that the uh, picture uh, or graphics of the soldier um, is this guy, the bot looking guy. It's just a placeholder. Obviously, well it may not be obvious if you're new, but it's not going to be the final uh, look of the person at all. They just use the uh, bots when they're building the legend. Also keep in mind that all of the animations for the attacks are still a work in progress and could change. Basically anything could change at this point. And I don't know if they give a uh, release date window for the soldier, but usually when they show off a new legend, it usually comes out within a month uh, in my experience. So let's go ahead and take a look at this and uh, we can kind of react to it together. Yeah, there we go. There it is. There it is. So the soldier is going to be cannon and blasters. Lots of big guns. Or rather one big gun and one little gun. This is probably the legend that most people thought of when they first thought of cannon. Alright, so there's one sig we saw right there. It looked like a little uh, a little rocket blast. Let's see if we can go ahead and rewind a second and look at that. So he shoots a little rocket into the air. Um, pretty basic, but honestly it's a good attack. So I'm, I'm assuming that's the neutral sig for the cannon. Personally, I'm not a huge fan of the cannon, but it is really, really good. Oh! Oh, that was sick. Let's rewind that a second. That was sick. Let's see if I can pause it right there. So, he pulls out a drone, hops on it, flies up a little bit, and shoots down. One of the cool things about the soldier is the drone, and you're going to see that coming up a lot. I really, really like the fact that they added the drone in there. It just makes the character have so much personality, and it just looks really, really cool. Oh. Oh, and that's the down, I believe, that's right? That's the down, yeah. Yep. that's the down yep. so good. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day, wherever you guys might be. Oh! There's the side. That was also awesome. Let's rewind that a second. So there's the down sig, and let's look at the, look at the sound, side sig for the, for the cannon. He basically pulls out the drone, uh, he he moves the cannon off his shoulder and brings it down like uh, holding it like a Gatling gun, and he just slowly walks forward while shooting forward. And I love the fact that the bot has angry eyes as well. And apparently the drone is also shooting. I think, or no? Oh, oh, okay. So he hits with the minigun, and then the drone comes in and hits with a missile. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. I love it. I love it. This is probably the coolest cannon legend by far, in my opinion. Look at that. Shooting the bullets through the cannon and then the missile strike from the drone. <laughs> I love the drone, man. It would have been really easy for them to just make the cannon a uh, typical like grenade or rocket launcher, but okay, he did a sig there, but it came out so fast you didn't actually see it. So let's let's keep watching here. He'll do it again. Alright, so the drone actually comes down and hits and then the soldier hits after that. So while you're holding down the SIG, the drone is up here. When you release it, I'm assuming the drone attacks in way in front, almost like uh, Lord Vrax's uh, blaster down SIG, um, the distance on that it looks like. so. Pretty pretty nice surprise attack move. So the drone comes in, shocks and electrocutes, and then the soldier comes in and shoots. <laughs> Bam! That is awesome. I don't know if that's the down sig or the side sig on the blasters, but that was awesome. If you guys don't know about the dev uh, live stream, ooh, that was also cool. Let's let's let's. I'm assuming that was the, the side sig because this must be the down sig. It's very similar looking. So 
he he puts a laser down on the ground, and then the drone flies by and drops a bomb on it. Very, very, very cool. Oh. Kind of similar to the side sig, to be honest, but a little less uh, range on it. A little bigger explosion, too, from the looks of it. Oh, wow! That uppercut on the corner was savage! <laughs> I don't think he even knew what he was doing. That was awesome. Alright, there's one more sig to take a look at, and there it is. That was it on the gun. So, basically, it's just kind of the same thing as the cannon sig where he aims his gun maybe like 45 degrees up in the sky and shoots a straight line shot. So the laser comes out first and doesn't do damage I don't think and you can hold it down and, that, and then the laser's there and then boom he shoots a sniper shot. Uh, pretty far distance, doesn't quite reach this platform but I think on other stages where there's platforms a little bit lower it definitely would. Um, so pretty much the same attack as the cannon neutral sig, which is kind of boring, but whatever. It, it looks like a nice, it's, it's honestly, it's almost the same thing as like the bow neutral light, except with a little more reach and obviously a lot more power because it's a sig, signature attack. And apparently it doesn't work when they're right on top of you because it, he was right on top of him and he did the uh, blaster neutral sig, it didn't appear to hit. Okay, he hit it right there. So those are all of the sigs. I don't know if I like the fact that the laser is coming out because it really shows exactly where to not go, which no other SIGs have that. You only have the character's um, animation to look at to know which SIG they're doing. And on the on the soldier, on a couple of his moves, you have that laser that shows, he, hey, I'm about to do this SIG, and, and by the way, it's going to hit right there. I don't agree with that. I, don't, I think the laser is cool. But at the same time, it really shows clearly. Like, that is awesome. Um, flying on the drone, that is so cool. That's the, that right there is the best looking SIG. I would have liked the missile to shoot up and then curve down instead of just shooting straight up. But it's all good. Um, I think for the most part, they did really good on the soldier. There's a couple things that I would have liked differently. I think the neutral SIG, like I said, like four times. I don't like it being the same as the blaster SIG. The missile's cool, but it should have, like... It should go in a different route. Um, but yeah, this is definitely the coolest looking cannon legend, in my opinion. Um, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, I love the fact that they have a uh, smiley face on there. Let's fast forward a little bit. Uh, get a little bit more footage of the uh, soldier here, because honestly, who knows when it's going to come out. With BMG, you never know. See another laser there, showing exactly where it's going to hit. That's, that's actually a really big disadvantage for the soldier. Because think about like Taros, when he has an uh, axe or, or a hammer, you could barely tell what sig he's going to do just by the posture of his like uh, body. But in, with the soldier, it, it's very obvious, so I don't, I don't like that. But a loss, alas, whatever. He seems to be pretty sweet. Um, you guys are probably wondering what are his stats. Let me rewind a little bit to where they're on the character select screen. So he's 5 strength, 6 dex, 4 speed, and 7 defense. So he's got quite a bit of defense and dexterity, which is honestly pretty good. But it means, I'm surprised, you would think his soldier would be a little bit more powerful, but whatever. The, uh, the stats seem to be pretty balanced for the most part. He's not super strong in anything. I'm a little bit uh, interested in the fact that he has defense as his highest stat. Kind of makes me wonder what he's going to look like in the final artwork. Hoping he looks, you know, different enough from the uh, soldier's uh, cross skin. Because cross already has a skin for a soldier. It looks exactly like a soldier, but from like World War II. This guy obviously using a drone and laser sights and stuff. I'm assuming he's more of a modern uh, soldier. So he should look quite a bit different from the World War II looking cross soldier skin, but we shall see. When the soldier comes out officially, I will definitely be making a video about him. I'll do a uh, video showing his SIGs again because sometimes they change a little bit. Um, obviously, uh, they usually come out with two or three uh, skins every time they come out with a new legend for that legend. 
So we'll be taking a look at all the new skins for the soldier when he comes out. We'll be we'll be testing him out. We'll be doing some 1v1s and giving an even more in-depth look at the soldier. If you guys want to see more footage of the soldier, be sure to check out the official Brawlhalla dev stream on Twitch. Uh, just go into the video archives. You, you should be able to find this video no problem unless you're looking at it like a year from now. But probably you're not. So anyways... Um, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out. And uh, be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. Uh, next video, I'll definitely actually be playing Brawlhalla. Uh, but with the soldier uh, being announced, I wanted to give a uh, video about him so you guys could get a good look. And uh, let me know what you guys think. Oh, that was pretty cool, actually. I really, really, really like him for the most part. Or her. We actually don't know if it's going to be a male or female. I'm assuming a male, but you never know. Um, let me know guys <laughs> let me know what you guys think about the drone too. That is in my opinion that is awesome. Alright guys, this is Lucian Sword. Take it easy. I will see you next video.